everyone in this video we'll be going over how to check out items and check items back in in easy office inventory so checking out items is like loaning out items to us another user or to yourself and then checking in is the process of returning items um, into the system so we'll be going into assets for this example and let's say we have an asset drill machine that we want to check out to a specific user here's the checkout button and so you click on checkout and the, this is the return on date and you can also choose to check out this item indefinitely if you don't know when you plan on returning this item. You can check out to a specific user, you can select a location at which the item will be at post checkout. There's also check custom fields that are visible if you choose to have them um, on the checkout overlay. And lastly, you can also see the reservations that already exist for that item. So over here, we can see that this item has these two reservations. So we want to make sure we don't clash with them. So make a sign. And here you can see we checked out the item and it tells you up till when the checkout is. You can also see the details right under the image of the asset that you have. Now, okay, so let's say you want to check the item back in. You're going to go into the item details page and click on check in. Here you see the checkout date and you can select the date which you checked that item back in. Let's say we checked it in 6.15. We also have the location at which the item can be at once you check it in, comments, and whether if there's a custom field for the item, you can also have that show on the check-in page. So the item has been checked back in. You can see that it's an available now and that's how we check out an asset and then check it back in.